Welcome back. At the end of the previous part, we saw another artificial blade, which is like... How? I thought Poppy was the only artificial blade. I, I don't understand. This is, this is not the way. So how do we stop this steam here? There's got to be some way to get rid of that. Some way to get around everything. Maybe down here. It's just a maze or something. Okay. Hello there, how are you doing? Don't mind me, just messing with the valve. Ooh, get this chest while we're here. You're all mine. We got common core crystal. Alright then. Just wondering if I could jump up there. Maybe sneak up that way. So I'm worried if I jump up there, I'm gonna end up the wrong area and gonna slip off or something like that. We'll just go the, we'll go the right way, because clearly we're meant to turn that valve and go off in another direction. Look at that bridge. Yeah, right, sir, how are you doing? Don't mind me. So weird with the aggro off, it really is. Don't think I'm going to get used to that at all. Wait, please. Hey, who is she? How does she exist? She is quite fast. She not listening. Nothing for it but to chase. Where is she going? Is she leading us somewhere? This thing should we be following? That's the question. Like, she could be actually, like, making us follow. Knowing full well we will, etc, etc, etc. She'll lead us into a trap. And then they'll take Pyra. Well, Mithra at this point. Or Mithra. Don't mind me, don't mind me. <laughs> Still so strange. So that we're going very, very full circle. She didn't go here. She went much further. Wait! Just stop it! Master Pon? We're not letting her get away. Poppy, help chase two. Go as fast as possible. Do I jump down then? Possibly. Oh, I was hoping to see if I could jump over onto like one another, like another one, another one, another one. But no. It's not to be. It's not to be. Well, this looks like we're going to be in a fight soon. They're not here! Where did she go? Tora, wait. Did you know that girl? She seemed somehow similar to Poppy. It was... Lila! Lila? The artificial blade Tora's dad upon and Grampy Pon were making! Tora recognized her anywhere! Master Pon, they're an ether furnace reading nearby. Up there! Lila, it is you. Ether furnace reading detected. Initiating protocol. Here we go, then. Well, apparently not. Takes a while to load. Let's show him a thing Fighty, or three. I'll let you know if you start slashing. Let's get our aggro down Copy first. Alpha, 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 Oh, <laughs> I like just the voices I'm hearing right now. Yeah, we're not right smack on on the side there, unfortunately. Hmm. So I would now go to Lightning Bolt, but. Just looking at the list and everything, it's like... Just getting that before I lose it. Just 
attack. Rock. I am Rock. Rock. Shield. Always have been. been. Always will. Adjusting be. Cycle. All right, Rock, calm down. Adjusting pattern. Jaguar slash. Yeah. Ah, make miss. haste and retreat. Oh, you I met with this invisible. Indeed. It. It's quite rude. Yeah. Ready for Poppy's full Wild side. Short punch. For sure. Anchor. My spirit. I thought we were going to get supernova, are we? Guess we'll go with the water one. May as well. <laughs> that be on the screen right now. Great damage sustained. Indeed. Adjusting Not enough going up from the one from Tora there. Let's get so we could go with another Earth one. So we go to over to Wolfric. So now we got the lightning one. Just needed to build up with Naya there. Bitey, bitey, bum. Get that going, please. Thank you. Great damage. Indeed. I need to learn like the, the correct point to attack with these guys. Change over to me for quick. Oh, it's gonna change over to. Oh, it's gonna change over to rock so we can get. Oh, we can get smash now. That was correct, wasn't it? Smash. At that point when it was launched. I'm trying to learn the time, like, time to hit with Rock here. Still very confused at this point. Well, not confused, just need to learn. Like that, it's like, ah. Wrong timing. It's like, one, two. Seems like he goes for four. Anyway, let's get this going. Me first. Yo, let's Mita. finish this. Superb. Want lightning and water, so let's go with Cora. I have to deliver, or I'll die out of shame. Superb. Tora, Poppy, go, Yora. go, go. Tora, right here. Uh, Poppy, spinning burst. slash. A burst. Let's cool. keep it up. Astounding. Let's go, Rock. Rock, leave it to me. I'll be done before you know it. So close. Get him, Nia. Throw him on at your service. There's the burst. Tora, Poppy, Yori. Tora, right on time. Ah, I mistimed it. Storm. Great. And another one. Indeed. Excellent. Go ahead, Mithra. Mithra. Just let me handle it. Ah, I mistimed again. Great. Get him, Nia. On it. Um, Adenine. Adenine. Work hard, research hard. You won't be getting away. Excellent. Enemy down. There we go. Lovely. Getting a better idea with the combat properly now. All these new options I've got recently. Probability of success falling. Switching to strategic retreat mode. I love Poppy's point. It's just like boing 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 boing. It's like it's elasticated. It's very strange, but funny. Ooh. 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 Wow. Well, just waiting for all of them to pop up before I actually go look at the affinities. Perhaps rest and enjoy view for a bit. Thought it was going to be across the bridge then. Are you done? Right. Okay. Actually, look at this now. So, characters, Rick. It will help, I think. Hmm. I need to get your trust up. I have something fun I want to try. And again, your trust as well. All right then, very well. Cue. I will protect you. And 
Mm, puppy. Puppy strength. Cool. Still need to sort core crystals and stuff like that. I'll do that when I fi finally get to the point where I'll go off and do some other things. It's going to be a while before we do that. It's just I don't want to touch stuff because I'll get pulled into things. So it's like maybe get a few of those pentagon crystal core thingies. What they're called? Pentagon cores, isn't it? Yeah, I'll get a few of them, but that's pretty much it. Don't want to mess around with other things just yet because it will grab me. Where am I going anyway? I have no idea. Oh, there, there we are. We're in the right location at least. She's gone. Ether furnace reading lost. It seems she has escaped. Lila. Long time ago. Grampy Ponsusu and Dada Pontatazo were working on her. Her name was Lila. Grampy Pon and Dada Pon and Tora all wanted to become driver. However, not single one of us have potential. So we decide to work together and make artificial blade. Blade even we can use! But then... I mean, come on. I know it's meant to be sad and all, but we can see who it is. Clearly. You must run, Tora. Take this and go. Someday you finish what we started. After that, Tora hide out in Torigoth City, making Poppy based on blueprints and ether furnace dad upon left for Tora. Don't you have any idea who the attackers were? Tora not know who, but they definitely wanted to steal Lila. If it was Lila they were after, how'd she end up here in the Empire? It looked like there were Imperial soldiers after her. Tora have no idea. But one thing is most confusing. What's that? When bad guys attacked the lab, Lila was not finished. There only one who could finish making Lila, Dada Pontatazo. Which means Tora's father must still be alive somewhere. Dada Pon must be held captive by whoever using Lila. You there? Don't move. <gasps> but I've got aggro off. How dare you? Imperial soldiers. You! So we meet again. Driver of the Aegis. Lady Morag! She's the one! That mechanical girl took down our squad! What? Hang on a minute. Where the hell did you get that idea? Unfortunately, they cannot tell difference between Lila and Poppy. So, Rex, was it? Rex, I'm very disappointed to find you stooping to such lowly crimes. Lowly crimes? What the heck? I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guys. You can't tell the difference? That's just racist. How dare they? There's clear differences. I'm going to get my aggro down quite simply. I'm going straight for Morag. Mm, we're not on the side, are we? Make sure everyone focus on that one, on Morag. Everything else should probably be taken out. We're AoE and such. 
will protect you from get out of this alive after all. Reaching sand for sure! Be here and smash! Be here! No! He likes a dead body! Just go cool! Be here and pop three! Be here and spinning in! This is good, this is good. What? Be here! Try to keep it up! Be here! I think we can avoid damage better than that one. Let's get that going. There we go. Oh, so close. What? What? It's water as well, so it's perfect. Let's get that going straight off. So if we can build up to the water attack again, that'll be lovely. It won't be that just give me the word. Liz! Yeah! My dead finally got something right. Again. No effect. Let's get the ruinous again. Farewell. Blade combo. Third awesome. What? Short. Right, man. Such a nice big yeah. attack there. Judgment! Anchor shot! The stone one going now. We will not Let's get the thingies that are going around here. Let's get that topple as quickly as we can. Just head over to Rock. Let someone to launch, please. No one launched. Ah. Still, still don't know how the rocks work out out here. Let's get this going on more right there. Thanks for the support. I need to look at like making a good blade setup really. To get stuff sorted in terms of like um the water one there. Yeah, get, get like some launch, topple, etc. etc. Get get a good set of blades that make that work out nicely for me and then learn it. That's what I need to do, I feel. But again, that's one of the things where it's like I go off and learn that in between the parts. It's like, we are not Rock, going off on. to go level up. So it's like, no, I'm going to have to do it slowly in all these fights that we get randomly throughout the yeah, yeah. game. Leave it to Korra. Tora, Poppy, Poppy. Tora, all Tora right no on time. Panic. Storm. Astounding. Astounding. Yeah. Astounding. Lovely. Your skills have improved, boy. Mitra! I know, I know. I won't use that power, okay? Let's stick to foresight for this. If you really need to attack, I'll hand it over to Pyra. Thanks. Here comes the awesome music. I locked it up. It's called Counterattack. The Aegis has changed. What happened to her appearance? Answer me! You want answers? Then put the swords away! What's wrong with you? I'll listen to your confession while you lie defeated. Rex, after this foresight, I'll switch to Pyra. Understood. Impossible, he dodged it. Now it's my turn. Lady Mora, look at the Aegis, so you can change at will. Eat this! Pyra? We can do this, without hitting them. Ha! <laughs> it's like you read my mind. <laughs> Are you holding back on me again, boy? We just don't have any reason to fight you. <sighs> Enough, both of you. I know you. You're from the Argentum Guild's Intelligence Division. Lady Morag, stand down arms. These not the ones who infiltrate the facility and attack your soldiers. Hmm. 
Then the culprit behind the attack was not the artificial blade standing here now, is that right? They very similar, but not the same. Nira Nira saw her with own eyes. I had a feeling we were being watched since our arrival. I'm quite sorry for causing concern. Nira Nira has been auditing Argentum Trade Guild. Ah, so you were keeping an eye on us because we came in on a guild ship. How ironic that your suspicion should happen to prove our innocence. It appears I was too hasty in judging you. I should not have attacked you so suddenly. My apologies. No, no, that's fine. Nobody got hurt in the end. I'm just glad it all got cleared up now. An apology from the illustrious Flamebringer. A rare reward in itself. Taurus still not happy! Should get years' supply of tasty sausages as compensation! Master Bon, have some self-respect. But sausages are awesome. Hmm. I will do what I can within my own means to compensate you. Sausages! By the way, the culprit who fled the scene, might I ask what manner of connection you have with them? You must tell me all. Fade out. Fade in, I assume. I see. It seems it would be best for all of us if we work together for the moment. Us work with you? Indeed. My goal is to capture the artificial blade and track down the criminals behind its actions. And from what you just told me, those I seek likely have Tora's father held captive. Would you not say our interests align? Uh, I guess so. Well, it's definitely better to have her working with us than against us. We shouldn't take the power of Frigid, jewel of the Empire, too lightly. If she went all out on me, even I wouldn't be able to hold back. And then, we'd burn this place to the ground. I am honored that the Aegis herself thinks so highly of me. You may not remember it, but I faced you a few times before. Let's just say it wasn't easy. Oh, really? But that's a story for another time. What do you say, guys? I can't deny I'd rather avoid making an enemy of them. So I'm assuming that backstory is going to be in the Torna DLC. All right, then. So, from this moment on, I suppose we're allies. Well, lovely. For the moment, I will return to the palace. If you learn anything new, please send word. I will instruct the palace guards to allow you audience with me. All right. Well, that ended quite nicely, didn't it? Are you sure you wish to partner yourself with these people? Just as you were not using your full strength, neither still were they. Yet you saw the power they demonstrated. How could I not feel intrigued? Drawn by your driver instincts? Something like that. And besides... Hmm? I get the feeling that if I stay near that boy, I might bear witness to something quite extraordinary. Indeed. There's the clear bad guy. It sounds like you have quite the adventure. But it's good that you work things out. Anyway, we'll see if we can track Lila down somehow ourselves. I too will see if I can find any leads. No matter what, Mui Mui and Fred will find Professor Tatazo. I like that it's clearly obvious we know who he, he, like he's the bad guy. 
but they don't, so we have to play along. Anyway, right then. So how are we supposed to track down this Leela? Can we not just ask around in the streets like we usually do? Might not be that helpful. It was night when it happened, so I doubt many people saw her. Meh <laughs> Time for Tora to show genius skills. You have some kind of idea, Tora. Tora surely must be Dadpon, Dadapon, who finished building Lila. Yes, you told us as much last night. And Poppy made based on blueprints Tora got from Dadapon. So Lila and Poppy use basically same design. That thing popped from nowhere outside. Which would mean they are constructed from very similar materials. Exactly yes. Oh, I get it. If we ask around to find out who's been buying those materials in Moradain, it might lead us to whoever built her. Rare good suggestion from Masterpon. Yeah, that's so harsh. So Tora, what materials exactly would they need to make an artificial blade? Well, if a furnace is obvious, but apart from that, also need... Tetra Circle, Snake Joint, Black Ash, Delta Vessel, Rabbit Diode, Morph Orb, Photonic Coil, Fairy Tail Belt Pulley, Arc Indicator, Insect Chip, Perfect Range Sensor, Bion Connector, wait, 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 nobody's gonna be able to remember all that. Tora not even say 113th of the list yet. Uh, there were a couple of names in there that sounded familiar, though. That buying connector was meant to be easy to salvage around Gormor, right? Actually, almost impossible to find anywhere other than Gormor around this season. So whoever we're looking for would have to Im import them from Gormor, am I right? Perhaps we might find some leads at Port Anagam? Anagam? We don't have much else to go on. So it's worth a try. I suppose. Lila's location or Leela's location, one of the two. Yes, 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 yes. We made it back in one piece! Oh, I forgot I sent them off. Safely. Indeed, that group then. It all turned out It all turned out? Well, alright then. Banner etching contract. Okay. What are these contracts? No idea. Don't want to look at them yet. I want to do that one. But can't do that yet. And do the pink ones first. Hmm, get fat foods. Let's do long awaited work. So let's see here. We've got Mega Lance we're not using I'll there. You my strength. And we have got a bit ball we're not using there. You need my help? Okay. So who else do we want to send oh, out? May as well send you. Let's see if I can light a fire under their butts. Indeed. Ardent Lancers. The Ardent Lancers stand ready to smite evil. Am I? Squad dispatched. Okay, cool. Right, so. Well, I'm sure there was something else I wanted to check. I think it was with the blades here. It's like, still no. Just looking like maybe there's like a, a thing somewhere that makes it so it switches back to Pyra. So I'm just wondering, like, like, do we have that option? It would be nice because then I'd have a fire and a light blade. That'd be really cool. Maybe we should just fast travel looking at the distance there. So, go lower level. There you go. <laughs> Probably much quicker, isn't it, than wandering off, strolling about. Let's get going. See, it's right here. Huh. You're Perry Perry, right? Ah, Rex! Such a coincidence to meet here! You haven't brought any cargo from Gormar, have you? Have so! Even though you were in Argentum? It came from Argentum to Gormar, then Gormar to Morodain! Oh, I see. I guess that makes sense. Then Tora have something to ask Perry Perry. Did Perry Perry transport large quantity of buying connector recently? Meh meh meh! Talking about contents of shipment is a violation of trade confidentiality. Come on, we really need to know this. Uh, if it is request from Rex, Perry Perry cannot refuse. Perry Perry carried Bion Connector in yellow barrels. How many? At least ten, Perry Perry think. That's got to be it. Perry Perry nowhere shipment for? Sadly not having that information. Job was only bring cargo to port. But cargo unloaded here always taken off towards city. 
Maybe friends find cargo at inspection point near elevator? Only if recipient not pick up yet, of course. Alright. We'll have a look. Thanks, Perry Perry. That's very nice, Perry Perry. Let's see about that. Is it, oh, there's, there's no place closer. So we've got to run off there. I was just thinking maybe I could fast travel to that point as well. Just looking around this port here. Again, it's like... This area, not as interesting as the previous area in terms of looks so far. But we haven't actually headed out beyond the city. It just seems to be like one giant desert so far, doesn't it? It's like, but that could be interesting. It just depends when we actually get to see what's out there. Because the city itself is very... Just industrious, really, isn't it? It's, it's like, yeah. I'd like to actually see something else going on. It would be nice. Okay, it's just quite far until this port thing here. This this checkpoint is like, come on now. All right, so where are we at? Yellow barrels. Yellow barrels. Yellow barrels. Yellow barrels. I can't see any. Hmm. Weren't there some over there the first time we came here? Were there? I didn't actually take that in. Someone let me know if that's true. Come to think of it, I do recall something of that nature. According to memory of Poppy, yellow barrels were definitely there. So that means someone must have picked them up already. I can only assume as much. Well, that leaves us without any needs. Ah, oh, man. Tora not about to give up so easy. Tora, remember, there is junk shop in Alba Kavanich. We ask for info there? Another rare good suggestion from Master Pond. A junk shop, huh? Yeah, they might know a thing or two about parts for artificial blades. Then what are we waiting for? They did. Okay, so where are we going? I didn't want that menu. It's like just the menu is just all the way, all, all wrong way around here. Okay, so ba -ba -ba -ba. that's the closest one. Let's see if we can get this little bit done before we end this part. Let's get going. Like, ugh, we're, on the, we're on the roof. It's probably throwing me off. I thought it would be in the street, but but no. Whoa! And we're there. Oh. Hey, can I ask you something? Sorry, but I don't do small talk with people who aren't paying customers. Maybe if you bought something, I'd be more willing to chat. What do you say? Eight. There we go. So, what were you wanting to ask? Toro want to know if somebody bought certain parts in large quantity or took them to somebody. When you say certain parts, there are quite many variety. Tora lists them one after another, so if any rings bell, please say. Really, we're doing this again? Tetris circle. Snake joint. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. I do have some info on that last one. Me me me? Over already? Master Pond looked disappointed. Alright. Please tell us the details. This old guy said he had a regular customer purchasing black ash. Pretty large scale stuff from the sounds of it. He was bragging about how he'd been rolling in cash for a while. Black Ash's key mineral used a shielding agent in Ether Thur Furnace. Sounds like we've got our guy. Do you know where we can find this old guy? Hmm. Now isn't that odd? I can't seem to recall. Maybe if you bought something, it might jog my memory. Why are you little? Do I really have to just buy stuff again? Ah! Thanks for your custom. And uh, what do you know? I think I just remembered. You're looking for an old bloke by the name of Dimmel. Dimmel. He's in the business of transporting black ash and other minerals mined in Morodain. Right now, you'll probably find him at the Turbine Tower, just across Midoral, Midoral Bridge. Be careful if you're going to meet him, though. Watch, thanks. Alright then, so I think oh, that is oh. actually a lovely place to end this part. Because it is quite far away from the looks of it. Maybe. Possibly. But yeah, we have to head out of the city from the looks of it or something like that. I, I am not 100% there, but we will be heading out. So we'll see you in the next part when we go find this guy. So, ta-ta for now.